All right. It says going live, so I think we are live. What is going on, everybody? Rogers Bass here with my live reaction to every single character demo in Genshin Impact. Now, many of you may know this, some of you may not. Last week, I did a sponsored Genshin Impact video where I played the game for the first time. I had no experience playing Genshin Impact before. It's obviously something right up my alley because I'm somebody who covers anime on my YouTube channel. I cover video games on my YouTube channel. But I ended up really enjoying myself during that stream. And it turned out that a lot of you really enjoyed watching that video too because I checked my YouTube analytics and obviously we've done a lot this past week we did the state of play we did avatar a whole bunch of stuff new one piece chapters but this genshin video did numbers this genshin video got 243,000 views and so i'm like look i enjoyed myself you guys obviously enjoyed that video so why not do more genshin impact seems right up my alley it's got anime girls it's got good orchestrated music now keep in mind I don't know much about this game other than the first three hours that I played on stream the other day where we met Lisa for the first time, who so far is best girl. I love Lisa. We met uh, Amber. We met the uh, the other guy. I forgot what his name was. And then the cool redheaded dude, too. But I'm excited. We got M. Sam in the chat already dropping a super chat saying, let's go. Well, let's get right into it. So I have the character demo thing already lined up over here. We're going to go full screen. We're going to watch all these trailers. I'm excited. I really am legitimately excited. Like I said, I know a ton of you really love this game, and I've really enjoyed what I played of it, so this is a win-win situation. Whenever I can run into something like this, where I enjoy it and my audience enjoys it, I'm jumping on the bandwagon. All right, so here we go. Game Prodigy just became a member, by the way, and saying, hype time for Genshin. You're watching all of them today? Yes, sir, Azim. We are watching all of them. Every single one. I've got the character demo thing over here. If I want to go full screen, I can go full screen if I so choose. But otherwise, it's going to be like this. Otherwise, it's going to be like this. So, I figured we'll do this in the direct style. There's no E3 this year. So, let's just hop right into it. All right. The first one is Yelan Shadow in the Rain. And I guess this is autoplay. How many of these do we have? 34. We're watching all 34. This has 8.2 million views. This character demo thing. 8.2 million Bruh. Unbelievable. Oh, watch them oldest first. Oldest to newest. Start with the oldest, bruv. Says Eric. Okay, I guess I'll start with the oldest. So I'm going to go. But then it's going to auto play to the beginning. Is there a way to flip this around? Can I change the order? No? I guess, okay, I'll just start with the oldest then. And then after every single one, I'll just flip backwards. This first one's only 50 seconds. So maybe this won't take me super long. But, okay, here we go. Back to the direct screen. Cryo chapter. All right, here we go. Let me turn this up. Let me go full screen. Cryo chapter, Cavalry Captain Kaya? I don't know. Let's see. I'm, I'm just excited to hear the music. Okay. I'm Kaya, Cavalry Captain for the Knights of... Oh, wait a minute. Didn't we meet him during the, um... During the little bit that I played? I know a great place. He's the pirate guy, right? I love the music, by the way, too. Okay, so he's got ice powers. Ooh. Wait a minute, why are we seeing Lisa? Don't tell me that Lisa and him are a thing. Lisa's my girlfriend, not yours. <laughs> my girlfriend literally cosplayed as Lisa, so there you go. Come on, let's get moving. Oh, so that was really short then. Wait, I kind of want to read his little character description thing. Wait, 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 wait. Let me go back. Cavalry Captain Kaya is quite approachable, at least when compared to his predecessor. He seems to know everything that's happening in Mondstadt. All right. Love the design. Love the eye patch. Damien in the chat says, they're a thing. Oh, I don't like him then. If Kaya's with Lisa, I don't like him. Next. <laughs> oh, this will be easy to do this in order then, okay? <laughs> but yeah, his design is great. All right, here we go. This next one is new character demo. Fischl? Glans der Nacht. Okay. Interesting, interesting, interesting. See, and this is going to give me a good idea of what characters I want to pull for when I start playing more of the game. Because again, like, I said a couple that I saw on the last stream when we looked at the character breakdown. I was like, I liked Yaimiko because, like I said, my girlfriend is the voice actress for the character that works for the publishing house. So that was cool. So I wanted to, I wanted to try to pull Yaimiko. I liked the Ice Girl. I don't know when we're going to see her trailer. And then, didn't we pull, um, 
Who, did, who, did, who else did we pull? We pulled like the nephew of the ice girl or something. So anyway, let's see. Fischl Glonsdernacht. All right, here we go. Let's see this. Tech Otakos. Okay. Okay. I shall send forth the Night Raven and unveil the truth. Okay. Okay. Can she turn into the Raven or is this like an Akatsuki kind of thing? Oh, oh, I like her theme though with the organ. Her design's kind of cool. Oh my god. Dude, the music in these trailers alone. Mm. Okay, so she's a bow girl. So she's like Amber then. Oh, the guitar? Mm. The Eye of Judgment has foretold my eternal victory. <laughs> she's got the. <laughs> hey, there's Amber. <laughs> I've lit them on fire. Just use your lightning. Okay. Thundering retribution. In the name of my Fraulein. So she's German? Want me to get your salary from the Adventurers Guild tomorrow? Wait, hold on. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. Wait, wait, wait. I want to see her little explanation thing. Where is it? Mysterious girl who calls herself Princess Der, Der Rutling? All right. And travels with a night raven named Oz. Okay, so the bird actually has a name, and she's from the Adventurer's Guild Intelligence Department. I mean, I liked her music, but so far, the one thing I've learned from Genshin Impact is that all the music slaps. That's what I've learned. So, I feel like... All right, let's get into the next one. She's like, she's okay. She's okay. We'll see. I like her outfit, though. Her outfit's neat. The raven thing is kind of cool, too, but I already... Have my electric girl, my electric waifu is Lisa. So let's get to the next one. Pyro chapter, chef de cuisine, Zheng Ling, I think is how you say her name. We're going to see. Also, can I choose what language these are in? Because I want to watch the one. This has 21 million views. Pyro chapter, chef de cuisine, 21 million views. Let's see this. Okay, her design's cute. There are many secrets to cooking. The most important is passion. My name is oh, I love this area. If there's nothing better to do, and I like a chef girl, that's cool. I like to cook. I'll be your friend. But if you do Breath of the Wild boys, okay. Take me with you. <laughs> <laughs> nice and spicy. I like her theme. Oh, what's the little, the little fire, fire bear? Oh, I love the... Well, hold on, I'll go back. I'll watch the trailer first, and then I'll go back. Oh, this is fun. I'm glad I'm reacting to all these. I'm enjoying myself. Okay, there's Lisa again. So they all get their own theme, then, I'm assuming. Okay, cute! Wait, let me, I'm going to go back to this. This shot right here is gorgeous. I think that was the key takeaway that I took away from the Genshin stream I did like a week and a half ago was how pretty the game was. Like I was, I'm playing on PC, by the way. Um, I know there's like rumors that it's going to come to Switch or whatever, so I might hop on the Switch version once the Switch version comes out, but I was playing on PC. Um, and it just, yeah, it was absolutely gorgeous. And the nice thing is I've got a nice computer, so it was like running real smooth. It looked really pretty. But yeah, I love this. This was very cute, cute trailer. Not my kind of character. I'm not really like, I, I, I don't know. I like, I like the seductresses. I like characters like Lisa. So I wanna see more characters like that. But she seems like someone that I would be friends with in high school. She seems cool. She seems cool. And she makes pancakes, that's a win. All right, so moving on. We're gonna go to the next one. This next one is Kiki? Kiki Icy Resurrection. For your next pull. Hey, thank you very much, Lucky. Appreciate that. Thank you very much. Thank you. I do like also in these trailers how they show off the different elements and how they fight. It's kind of neat. 21 million, though, for the chef de cuisine. That's unbelievable. All right, Kiki. Six. Oh, see, okay, so people clearly like um, uh, Zeng Ling instead of Kiki, then. If hers is 21 million and Kiki's only got like 6.4. 
Uh, Game Prodigy said, by the way, the uh, designs that you liked in the stream, you wanted Beidou, John, Shen He, I'm Miko, Raiden, Shogun, and a few others. Keep in mind, some characters don't have trailers, and you'll get to know them eventually in-game. Oh, it's pronounced Chi-Chi, not Kiki. Got it, got it. Chi-Chi is like the most famous one because it's a little bit of a troll character. Okay, well, let's see this. Troll character Chi-Chi. Here we go. Three, two, one. This is fun. I like that I'm doing this with the chat, too, because then you guys are educating me. This is good. I'm a newbie. I'm new to Genshin. Don't, <laughs> don't be mad at me for getting something wrong at first. All right, here we go. Here we go. Chi-Chi Icy Resurrection. Okay. An apprentice and herb gatherer at the pharmacy. We'll go back and read that later. There was a lot of stuff. I am a zombie. A zombie? I forgot what comes next. I want to build a snowman. Bruh? Will you help? Disney. The wind is frigid. Hey, uh, copyright infringement? Hold my hand, please. This wind could blow me well, away. Why is she talking like this? I like your theme, though. Life goes on. Mm. Orders given. Orders received. Orders given. Orders received. Do you want to build a snowman with me? Uh. Her theme wasn't bad. Chi Chi. All right, let me read what it said about her, though. Hold on. I don't know why she said she was a zombie, though. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. Where's her little character description thing? It's just gonna keep playing this over and over again. Here we go, here we go, here we go. See, cause I wanna learn the story of these characters too. Like, it's fun reacting to the character trailers and hearing their themes for the first time, but I wanna know more about these characters. If I'm actually getting into Genshin, I wanna know more about them. So Chi Chi is an apprentice and herb gatherer at the pharmacy. She is literally an undead with a bone white complexion, seldom has much in the way of words or emotions. So she's an ice zombie. A Jang Shi. See, I don't even know what that means yet. I am brand new to the game. You can see I did a video playing Genshin Impact for the first time a week and a half ago. I just got through the third area where I got Lisa. And then I fought the dragon and like the Star Fox boss. That's all I've done. So I didn't even know there were zombies in this game. This is brand new to me. So this is adding a whole nother level to the Genshin Impact experience now. I had no idea she's a zombie. All right. They're like the... Hessen Co. from Darkstalkers? Literally don't even know what that means either. I don't know what that means either. I know Morrigan. I know characters from Darkstalkers, but my only experience with Darkstalkers is from <laughs> their appearances in Marvel vs. Capcom. I know there's the cute cat girl and Morrigan. And then who's the other one? There's um, the other Batgirl. Reagan cosplayed her too. What's the other, the other Batgirl? Morrigan. Oh, who's the other Batgirl? There's Morrigan and then the red one that doesn't have bangs. Oh, what's her name? What's her name? What's her name? It doesn't matter. These Genshin people are like, man, this guy's going all over the place. All right, let's move on. Let's get to the next character trailer. Otherwise, I'm going to be... All right, Mona. Okay, now this is a character. Okay, Mona's got 4.7? What? Huh? 4.7. Mona, Fate, and Destiny. Roger, avoid Twitter. One Piece spoilers are all over the place, bro. I'm not avoiding Twitter for a full week. I... The way I am with One Piece now is if I get spoiled on One Piece, I get spoiled on One Piece. I don't particularly care as much anymore. The fact that spoilers come out a full week beforehand, I'm not avoiding Twitter and changing everything that I'm doing just to avoid One Piece spoilers. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to become a Genshin streamer. That's what I'm going to do. If I keep getting spoiled on One Piece chapters, I'm just going to be a Genshin streamer and say, sorry, One Piece. <laughs> They're getting 4.7 million views anyway. All right, let's keep going. Mona, Fate, and Destiny. Now, the thing is, I liked Mona so far based on the little bit that we saw of her in the game that I've played already. So there, there we go. All right. Thank you, by the way, to JJM, donating $20, saying this is a pleasant surprise. All right, let's do this. Mona, Fate, and Destiny. Let's go. Here we go. And I love her design. I'm going to, hold on, I'm going to pause this because I also really like her theme and it's in the very beginning. So, see now what I'm going to do. Sorry if this frustrates you. If their little descriptions are in the very beginning, they're not in the middle anymore, I'm going to pause it at the very beginning so I can fully appreciate the music and the character and seeing everything. So she's water. She's a waterbender like Katara from Avatar. A mysterious young astrologer who proclaims herself to be an astrologist, Mona Megistus, and who possesses abilities to match the title Erudite but prideful. I don't know. Oh, er, erudite? 
Erudite? Let's look this up. What does erudite mean? I've never heard this word before. Erudite. Having... Wait, hold on. Erudite. Erudite. Having or showing great knowledge or learning. Okay. Hopefully I'm erudite of indention impact by the time I'm done with all this. That's right. I'm trying to use it in a sentence. All right. Mona. Here we go. I love her design, by the way. 10 out of 10 design. Love the hat. Love the outfit. Love the cape. I think the hair is even cute. I'm not a fan of bangs normally. I think she looks cute. So let's keep going. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. So we got another witch girl. I am astrologist Mona Magistus. I like her voice too. Great astrologist Mona. The equipment repair bill is due, and so is the final payment for that celestial globe I ordered. Okay. Astrologers must rid themselves of material desires. I love that shot, the man. Beautiful. Clutter, can one see the true world around them? Okay, we got the air tree from Elden Ring. All right. Her movement seems kind of cool. She also kind of seems like a Fire Emblem character. So does her music. Talking about destiny and fate. You are the ocean's great waves. I ship Mona from Genshin Impact and Leo from Fire Emblem Fates. Final answer. <laughs> no, I like her. I like her a lot. I do. I just, I didn't even really care. Her trailer was kind of mid compared to some of the other ones we watched already, but... I like her design, and so she gets point for that. Oh, wait, wait, we already watched Chi-Chi. Hold on, let me go back. I don't want it to autoplay to the next thing. All right, this next one, here we go, here we go. We got the Mona-Lisa combo. That's true, you could put Mona on the team and Lisa on the team, and you got the two witch girls going at it. Pause, let's continue. Uh, I don't know how to say this character's name. I'm not even gonna try. I'm gonna wait until they say it, and here we go. Okay, character demo for Again, not even going to try. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Starts with a K. Okay, Driving Thunder. Oh, she's a cat girl. I am Kuching. You who? Kuching? Okay. Come on, enough procrastinating. I love her design. Time is against us. She's pretty. We live in an era of change. As the old yeah, I love this environment, too. A thousand years is about to be rewritten. Join me. Mm. Let us bear witness to this historical moment together. Mm. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Hers is kind of yeah. hype, actually. Incoming. Speed, Speed, of light. Light. Speed of light. Don't blink. We supersonic racing boys. Okay. With sword comes shadow. Oh, ho, ho. Is that is the most the anime move you can get. Your goal with each passing day. Ki Ching, all right, 100% want her. Definitely want her on the team. Hold on. Ku Ching. That's gonna be Genshin. <laughs> when they hear my wallet, Ku Ching! Because <laughs> I'm gonna be spending all my money trying to pull here, all right? It says, uh, Ka Ching has much to say about Rex Lapis's unilateral approach to policy making, but in truth, gods admire skeptics such as her quite a lot. Okay, and she's Electro. Why are all the best girls Electro? I don't understand. They make all the best girls Electro, because I know there's at least two other ones. There's like a pirate girl or something that we're going to see later, right? I know there's a pirate girl later that's Electro, and Lisa was Electro. It's like literally all the good ones are Electro. They got to spread it across the other elements. I don't understand. Because so far, what? Fire's got Amber and then the little chef girl. And then Ice has a little zombie troll character. But zombies also got that other girl that I like. So we'll see. All right. All the best girls truly are Electro. Um, Ade Wumi just super chatted and said what did you just say you should also watch the Tevat chapter storyline trailer if you've got time uh, it gives you a sneak peek into future characters i might check that out then i might check that out at the end of this all right let's see let's see so we watched kaching venti all right now venti this is going to be a fun one this is going to be a fun oh this is japanese voiceover wait i want the english one where's the english one i want the english one my friend voices venti Engl english dub shout out to erica she voices Venti, so I want to watch the one with her. Maybe they never did one with her. But regardless, let's see. Venti, a bard's business, 
Teyvat is a place where people of all sorts go about their business. Merchants move product, knights patrol, farmers till the land, and even an enigmatic astrologist must look to hers. Okay, bards might be the exception. Let's see this. Fenty, a bard's business. I'm down. We'll watch the English one later then. I'm not worried about it. I want to see it for the first time. Ah, you know what? No, I'm going to look at the English one right now. Hold on. English one. Let's see. Venti character demo English. I should just have this open in another tab. Here we go. Here we go. English voiceover trailer. This one, right? Character demo. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right. Shout out to Erica. All right. Here we are. There's an archaic tale to be told. That's wild! <laughs> that of which is of an ancient one. <sighs> That's my friend right that there! That which traveled among the gods. That of which beheld lands undone, seas spun. And I know people love Venti, apparently. That's sort of the thing I know about this game. Oh! How chained to your daily toiling you are. We're getting like a full cutscene for this one! intrude on a bard's leisure time. Oh! Oh, the music! <laughs> so now they're going on. Oh my god! Oh! With the. One of the many bards of Mondstadt who freely wanders the city streets. Hmm! Oh my god! Venti's theme is incredible! Some notes can't be played for just any Full of mystery, born from the branches of time. Okay. I gotta go back Unless and pause that. high winds blow you away. Mmm. Boom! dun 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 Mmm. Oh! 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 Oh my gosh! The fact, hold on, I gotta, I gotta pause, I gotta pause, I'm sorry. The fact that I can read, having never seen this trailer before, that I know the way the music is gonna go, based on how it's composed, is a good sign for the music. I love that, I love that, I love that. The music in Venti's is probably the best so far, of any of the tracks that we've heard so far. I really like the music in Venti's. Language and poetry mm. that flow with the wind. The layering of the different instruments, too. Dun -dun 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 -dun. All right, hold on. I want to go back real quick to the part, though, where there was something written on the screen. What is this? Full of mystery, born from the branches of time, a history of glory and sorrow, and witness to the divine. Oh, is that like one of the songs that the bard sings? Full of mystery, born from the branches of time. A history of glory and sorrow, and a witness to the divine. Yeah, obviously it is then. Okay. Venti's a beast. Can I hear that music again real quick? Just anyone. This part, this part right here. Lest the high winds blow you away. Build it up. Mm. Oh, that little, that little string thing at the end. Yes. Let them take you. That Erica's lucky. It's she gets to voice this character with the banging with theme. The Woo Let's go. I need Venti. Venti's a must get. I need Venti for sure. We need to pull Venti during the next stream. Venti is awesome. Next one. Okay, this next one is Klee. And that's what you missed on Glee. <laughs> All right, let's see this. I don't know if there's any other Glee fans out there. All right, here we go. I apologize. This is your first time finding my stream. Hopefully you're enjoying this as much as I'm enjoying this. All right, Klee, new character demo. Klee da da da. Okay, bo 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 bo. Let's see this, Klee. Okay. Legendary girl in red. Oh my god. I love that they're doing different things with these trailers, too. A lot of stuff there. Hmm? Are you here for playtime with Klee? Nope. Okay. Next trailer. Nope. Next one. All right. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
sorry. I'm sorry. I. <laughs> I'm sorry. 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 I'll watch it. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Let's go back, let's go back, let's go back. Okay. The music was good. Have a play time with Klee? Okay, so you'll be in charge of the storm watch. Storm watch, all right. Means you warn Klee the second you see Jean coming. Let's go! Okay, this is kind of cute. Fleeing sunlight, an explosives expert. So she's Bomberman. Okay, actually, I kind of like her theme now. Special total not for fish blasting extra exploding formula. She she runs like that the whole game. Lisa? Clee. Oh no, that's shot. Never mind. I thought that was gonna be Lisa. She's getting put in timeout or something. <laughs> what is going on here? <laughs> what? cute character. This is a cute character. I love what they're doing with their trailer, too. They're hyping her up. Just walking through all the danger. This needs lyrics to the song. <laughs> Alright, that was actually really cute. For as much as I was trolling earlier when I saw she was a preschooler, and <laughs> I didn't like that, the trailer itself was cute. This was cute. Maybe Noel the Confinement Room, the strongest fighter in Mondstadt. I'd rather pick Master, the Blessed Princess. Oh, so these are all the different names of other characters that it could have been that they were going to add. And then they just surprised you and they threw this little kid in there. <laughs> I No, it was a cute trailer. Honestly, it was a really cute trailer. But the music during the portion where after she's put in timeout and she's walking sounds like it needs lyrics. I The way she's running is also super funny, too. Like this part right here. Hold on. This part right here, I'm clean. I'm going to blow things up. Blow things up. I am clean, and everywhere I turn, things get blown up. <laughs> like, that's, that's kind of what I feel like we need for this. That shot right there is actually perfect, too. That just, like, destruction <laughs> happens anywhere she's around. <laughs> and this final shot, too, she looks backwards and throws the bombs. Like, that feels like out of a Smash Bros. character. I love Let's it. Let's go fish blasting together. Lore-wise, she is one of the strongest in the entire game. For real? Really? She's one of the strongest in the entire game. All right, well, we got to pull Klee, I guess. <laughs> That's fun. I'm sorry. Let's keep going. I actually, I, I'm going to give this one a like, actually. I thought that was a pretty funny one. I'm going to give that one a like. I'm gonna give the venti one a like. Oh, hold on, but I gotta give it on the other one because this is the English one. I'm gonna give the venti one a like too. That was funny. Both of those back to back. Those were bangers. Those were good ones. Those were good ones. I liked them both. All right, new character demo. Diana Wine Bro. I already know I'm gonna like this girl. Wine Industry Slayer. Diana. Drink the sea salt lizard and kiss your life as an alcoholic goodbye. Bro, what? Diana thinks to herself pridely only to be met by the lavish praises of the tavern's patrons. Okay. So she's like every alcoholic in Genshin Impact sponsor then? The wine industry slayer. Okay. I'm, I'm interested in this one. What is this character going to look like? I'm imagining when I hear the term wine industry slayer... I don't even have an image that comes to mind. Diana, let's see this. She's cryo, okay. Cocktail, she can't drink, what is this? Oh, I guess that's probably why she's slaying all the alcoholics then, because she can't drink. A young lady who's inherited trace amounts of non-human blood. She's the incredibly popular bartender of the Cat's Tail Tavern. Wait, she's the bartender? Wait, 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 wait. How? Wait, so it's... Uh, let's keep, let's keep watching. Let's keep watching. I'm not gonna ask any more questions. Diana, bartender of the cat's tail. I like the I music, though. I hefty fee for private events. My ears and tail are no prop, they're real. Proof, 
okay. There's just cats My everywhere? Is very busy. When I'm not at the tavern, I'm out collecting ingredients for new recipes. So, so unless something is urgent, don't bother me. The music is good, though. It sounds like something out of Marvel. On the rocks! On the rocks? <laughs> Vodka tonic! Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> what the heck is this? Dirty martini! <laughs> you, <blue girl. laughs> I would love this character if she didn't look like this. I, I wasn't waiting for you. I just happened to be resting. I, I literally would love this character if she didn't look like a kid. I would. I, I don't like the design. I just straight up don't. But I like the concept. I think it's funny that you have an, uh, like a bartender character who's obsessed with cats. I think that's cute. She's actually a really good support character, you guys said. And Ayush in the chat said her dad was an alcoholic, so she wants to rid the world of alcohol. But she's blessed, so every drink she makes tastes good. See, that's not... I mean, that's an interesting storyline, but I'm going to pass. Oh! Kieran in the chat just said... Diona is like Dionysus. Oh, I didn't even I didn't even put that together, honestly. I didn't even put that together, but oh, that's cute. I like Dionysus. I like Dionysus in Hades. All the different poison effects you can get with Dionysus in Hades are like amazing. Also, if you've never seen the musical The Frogs, sorry, I gotta go off. Hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. I probably get a copyright claim for this. I don't care. It's a good song. Dionysus. Or is it Dionysus? Not the BTS song. No, hold on, wait. The frogs. Hymn to Dionysus. Gods of the theater, smile on us. This is the song, right? Nope, this isn't what I'm thinking of. This is it. <laughs> That's what I was thinking of. Dionysus. All right, anyway. Moving on. Child? There's been enough children as it is. I don't need to see any more kids in this game. Get the kids out of this game. Show me more Lisas. All right. Child, a letter to, to Sneznia. Okay. Dearest sister, I've been away for so long. I've almost forgotten the cold of our home. Okay. You know I grow oh. restless when life I kind of like his design. Before. Though in Leor. Fuses of excitement can be found. I actually everywhere. really like his design. Just waiting for the right spark. The cool little headpiece <laughs> thing and the sword. Okay. <laughs> Yo, he. Okay. Tartaglia. His name is highly feared on the battlefield. He's got a water spear and stuff, and he's surfing. Come at me, dude. I love how each time we get through one of these character demos, the trailers get better and better. Not much of an adversary, but enough for us. Like in terms of the choreography and the different things they're doing with the animations and Time the environments. Okay. That's so. Da -da -da. If you were smart, you wouldn't charge. Okay, so he uses the constellations to fight or something. It'll be an easy victory, but I still Ooh. hold back. That part slapped. Hold on, we're gonna have to go back to that. But Tonya, rest assured, the future that Sarita desires, the future the people of Shnejnaya desire. Shnejnaya. Cool. I love that. I love how it ended too with the little piano track. Beautiful. So I've actually we've seen Tartaglia, right? Didn't he show up for a little bit in the story that we played? That shot is sick. How it transitions into his little title screen. That right there, that they're paying the editor big bucks for that. That right there is fantastic. Roger, one piece live action news is out, but it's not all too big. It's just the it's the sets, right? It's just the sets. I'll look at those later. We're doing Genshin Impact right now. I'll look at the sets later. We're not doing that right now. I, I want to get through all these character trailers. I want to watch them. I'm invested. We're focusing on one thing right now. We'll do one piece later. All right. Here we go. This next one. Zinyan. Rock on. Okay. Ooh, okay. I think I'm already going to like this one. 6.8 million views. It's got a rock guitar and she's fire element. Let's go. Blazing Riff. Oh, yeah. Okay. Her design is cool. The sole rock and roll musician. She has the name and rock and roll is the game. I like her. I'm the only one who plays it. 
in Leela Harbor. Been thinking about staging concerts. Wait, why does she have a Ruth Langmore accent, though? What say you sign me up for your world tour? What say you sign me up for your world tour? Okay. Almost about to go live over here. Coming? About to go live. Guitar constellation and stuff, okay. Oh, I love it. Oh, that's cool. Pyrotechnics, so it's like using the theatrical theming. I like this. Okay. Dude, that's cool. You make a stage for That's what I'm talking about. I'm on fire lately. Look out for my next performance. Love her design. Love her design. Love the concept. Don't know if I'm a fan of the accent is the only thing. I don't know how, how much of a fan of the accent I am. Let me go back to the very beginning real quick. I want to see what it said about her. The sole rock and roll musician, she rebels against ossified prejudices using her music and passionate singing. Okay. Cool. Cool. I love the concept, though. I do. I like the concept a lot. All right. Next one. Zhang, Zhang Li, the listener. 27 million views! 27 million? Okay, so this must be the boy everyone's thirsting over then. Zhang Li, the listener. 471,000 likes, 27.5 million views. Million with an M. My chat is going off! CEO of Geo, best daddy, here we go. Daddy, Daddy Geo. Oh my gosh. All right. What are we in for? I don't know. We're about to find out. Zhong Li, let's go. We last left off with ancient Liyue beset by an ocean demon and a mountain. That's a, a Fire Emblem voice actor. Rex I recognize him. Mustered his adept eye. This guy? To restore peace to the land. They say that before he set out, he spoke these words. Okay, I can I see the appeal. Oh! 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 The music! Wait! 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 Funeral parlor! Wait! Hold on. There's stuff going on here. Wait a minute. Okay. Oh! That music! Wait, did he just make a coffin or something? Like what? Just a pillar? Okay. Mmm. 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 Yup! The an age style on this trailer! I wish not for dominion. Yet I cannot watch the common folks. Oh! 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 Oh yeah! I see what oh, oh yo! This might be the best one yet! In terms of editing and choreography and music! He drops meteors from the sky too! And he Dr. Stone Boys! He's a must pull! I gotta get this guy. Dude! To cleanse the land and defend our safe harbor. That was the first contract in Leo. Yes! And now, the final contract, too, has been set in stone. Oh, and that's cool, too, that he said it's set in stone? Wait, I wanna... Wait, 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 wait. I wanna go back real quick to something. This, this transition is fire. Watch this. Watch this. That seems like something out of, like, the most hype K-pop <laughs> music video of all time. I love this transition where it's this into the silhouette and then it flipped, dude. Vago Mundo, Geo, a mysterious expert contracted by the Wang Sheng funeral parlor, extremely knowledgeable in all things. So they just said, look, we're making the best character in the game so far at this point. He's one of the strongest characters. Christiana said, by the way, the reason you recognize the storyteller's voice is the storyteller at the beginning is Jiraiya's voice actor. It totally is. It totally is. That is Jiraiya's voice actor. And Guile Soup said, when Zhang Li first came out, he was kind of bad. But now the guy literally makes you untouchable. He's insane. Dude is busted. Really? I just love the music. Some of these transitions in this trailer, like, where this little thing. I know I'm, I'm, I'm geeking over the music, but I just love what they're doing with the choreography and the music. This part where you're like the dun-dun-dun and you see the spears come down, this right here. 
Here we go. That. Loved it. Loved it, loved it. And I didn't know he was going to do like a Dr. Stone thing. I will have order. Dropping a meteor. Yeah, this, I like. He's one of the best. He's one of the best. I got to get him too. I'm giving this one a like. I'm giving this one a like. I'm giving this one a like, for sure. That is a like right there. That one's getting a like, no doubt about it. Roger, make sure you don't get spoiled on his story. He makes all combat in the game easy mode. We also understand that you want to keep going. This trailer is amazing. You are correct. He also has Hisoka's voice actor. It's done then. He's so, is it today Hisoka's birthday, by the way? Happy birthday, Hisoka. Yo. Leo super chatted and said, going back and watching the older character demos, it is wild seeing how much the quality evolved. Starting with Venti's is where it really takes off for me. That's exactly how I feel, too. Just watching these for the first time, that's exactly how I feel, too. Yeah. And Bryant Brawler super chatted and said, Genshin concert character themes, search this and then click on the first video. It's great live concert music. I feel like that's going to get me copyright claimed, so I'm not going to do that live on stream, but I will definitely check that out. That is good to know. All right, so let's do this. Albedo is the next one. Contemplating in chalk. Okay, 27 million to 6 million. But Albedo is also apparently a pretty popular one, isn't he? Soil, the origin of alchemy, the basis of all life. Chalk, the blank canvas on which to paint life. So he's an artist kid or something? Albedo. Okay. Let's see this. This is Timaeus' newest design. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. I wanna, I wanna boost the quality because right now it's crunchy 720p. Okay, let's see this again. Albedo, contemplation in chalk. Hmm. A commendable achievement. Twenty more years, and perhaps we can let him make a start on the textbook Sucrose uses today. Okay. Oh, I can see how someone would like this character. They really are up and up the quality. Oh, that's cool. A genius note is the the what? The something. I'll go back and read that later. I love this uh, ice environment too. I gotta get further in the game so I can get there. First fourth. Okay, so what are these? Like giant flower platforms? Okay. Ooh. Hey, there's Klee. <laughs> he said, sorry, I'm busy babysitting today. Just come with me. <laughs> the universe. The sable I like his aesthetic. Void. Earth. The accumulative memory of time and being. All right. Soil. The origin of alchemy. There's Shoji. The of all life. Shock. The substance from which primal life is molded. He took a butterfly and he turned it into a bird? And it's because it was made in chalk? Imagine this character must be broken. Man. The music sounds like something out of Mario Galaxy 2. There's Klee throwing a bomb. What, are they related or something? No, not at the. Not at the what? What? Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> what is Albedo saying? Wait, so are are they related? He's basically Edward. Wait, hold on. Wait, wait. Let, let me go back real quick. Wait, wait. He's basically Edward Elric. Oh. Albedo's actually okay. Oh, him and Klee are cousins. But essentially, he's her adopted brother. Oh, that's cute. They're half-siblings. Oh, so hold on. I want to read this real quick. A genius known as the Creta Prince. He's the chief alchemist and captain of the investigation team of the Knights of Flavonius. Oh, okay. So he's actually a pretty important character then. Because we met the Knights during the first time that I played the game. He's basically Klee's adopted brother. Don't listen to the chat. They are not cousins chat. Adopted brother. 
Got it, got it. Also, yes, I'm aware the, the One Piece uh, Netflix thing is out right now with the sets. I'll look at that later. We're not doing that right now. Peace and love. Thank you very much. All right. I liked Albedo. So far, my favorites are still Zhongli, Venti, and honestly, Klee. The Klee trailer was one of the best, which I didn't think I was going to really like, but I really liked that one. Okay. Ganyu. Let's see this. Ganyu Radiant Dreams, the fragrant licorice, the sweet flowers, the picturesque snowstorms, the falling glaze. For the girl descended from the Key Lin, this is all exactly what she dreamed of. Ganyu Radiant Dreams. All right, well, let's see this. I'm excited. Also, I got to keep boosting up the quality of the video. Okay, here we go. Mm -hmm. Chat saying best girl, really, now. I think I like her. As a food, it's not the healthiest option. I like her voice. But feasting my eyes on it works well. And I like her design. So I cannot permit you to trample these flowers. So she's Aaron. Oh, her design. Whoa, she looks even better in the artwork than she does in game. That artwork is gorgeous. Born of ice and frost. Oh, and the music. Also, she's an ice girl. Okay, that's the zombie girl. By monsters. Huh? So I was asleep. I I love her hairstyle. It was just a dream. Love her hairstyle. All hail. If you want a character to have frontal bangs, that's how you do it. Those are cute bangs. Whoa! Look at oh, I love too the the one string in the back that's like super high pitched. And the music? I love when they do the thing with the silhouette, too. I I really like her. I really, really like her. Hold on. I want to read real quick. And I want to look at her character artwork real quick. That transition was also beautiful. Yeah. She's really cute. The Penaloon, Plenaloon Gaze? Secretary at the pavilion, the blood of the Keelin, an illuminated beast, flows within her veins. Yes. Yes. This one's a yes. Her trailer, it, it was it was cute, and there were moments of greatness in it. But her trailer isn't getting the like. I like her. I like her design. I want to pull her. But the trailer wasn't the same level as the three I've given the like to yet. The like to me, the like is precious. The like has got to be given to the best of the best. Just because I like her design, I think her trailer could have been a little bit better. But I like her. I want to pull for her. Ganyu. All right. Next up, we got Zhao. Zhao the Doombane. Perpetual agony, ephemeral circumstance, inexplicable hatred. Okay. Okay. Got the Japanese flute in there. You got an Oni mask. All right. Oh! Oh! We Demon Slayer boys! Inuyasha? Sit, boy! <laughs> Yo, I, I like his design. Mm. Very much an Inuyasha character. He's got the beats, he's got the little. Oh, he looks cool, man. Bum, bum, bum. Is he gonna transform or something? He has to. The price I pay. Vecna? Eons of slaughter. Ephemeral circumstance. Perpetual agony. This is nothing new to me. What's happening? These severed karmic binds. Oh. Okay. Disperse. 
dun, dun, dun. I thought he was gonna do more though. I was left kind of underwhelmed when he was bound up with the with the upside down stuff, and he had his demon face on. I thought he was gonna do something cool. I mean, the design is still awesome, but I feel like for a character that looks like that and sounds like that, they could have gone a little harder. Let me let me read what it says here. Hold on. These are a Yaksha Adeptus who defends Lu, uh, Liu. Heralded as the conqueror of demons and the vig vigilant Yaksha. Okay. I mean, I like I like the design a lot. I really do. His banner's actually up right now. Did you not see the spears coming out? No, I saw the spears coming out of the ground, but I don't know. I thought he was gonna I thought he was gonna transform or something. When you see a shot like this, I thought he was gonna go full demon mode and like grow horns and get some giant looking form. I mean, it was fine. It was fine. It's cool. He's cool. I, I might try to pull him if he's available right now. But he, he's all right. He's all right. He's all right. That's a cool shot, though. I really like that one. Okay. Hu Tao. Let the living beware. All right. So we're going from a heavenly yaksha to Hu Tao. Also from the funeral parlor. What's going on with all these characters from the funeral parlor? When the funeral parlor is performing important rites, we appreciate it if people keep a respectful distance from the proceedings. But if you insist on gate crashing a funeral, I'm sure we can squeeze you in somewhere. 17 million views. So she's basically saying, if you crash our funerals, we will kill you. We'll squeeze you in. We'll make an appointment for you. Let the living beware. Hu Tao. All right, let's go. I'm down. Hey, uh, you sure we're going the right way? Doubt there's any treasure in this creepy place. Okay. This treasure map's bow ours. We just followed all the way. Hey, wait. <laughs> I like that they're doing a whole Did story thing here. Here, something. Yeah, man up. We're just imagining things. Oh, dun dun dun. <laughs> She's got these little ghosts. Who are you? Oh. Quick, oh! This song slaps! Wait, 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 wait! Oh! 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 <laughs> wait! Order of duality. Wait, we got. Hold on, I gotta rewatch this again later. Hold on. I like her design too, and I like the concept. I like what they're doing with the text. people. That song though. Not even worth the tease. Guess I'll need to send you off myself. Yeah, funeral parlor girl, we need to pull for her. Also, her tra <laughs> What? Zombie. Zombie. <laughs> so, did she come out around Halloween or something? What the heck? So she's whipping the ghost around? <laughs> she's Perona. She's literally Perona from One Piece. On the other side. Yeah, I like her. That was an excellent trailer, by the way, too. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I like her. I like her. I like her. That's Zhang Li's boss? Zhang Li Sugar Mama? What? Perona? Wait, this. I want to watch this part again. This was. I wasn't paying attention. The music was so good here. Fragrance and Thaw. The 77th director of the funeral parlor. Mm. Farewell. Uh, uh, uh. This one, this one's getting a like. This one's getting a like. This is the best of the best. This one's getting a like. This is up there with the other ones. Just for that little. Because I love that it's got the spooky theming in the trailer. I like her design a lot. I like that she's fire. Because there haven't been very many fire characters that I've really liked the designs and the concept for. I think it's funny that she's the boss of Zhang Li, who was like the badass Dr. Stone dude who was summoning meteors from the sky. And she's making the zombie character actually useful. So, what, so is she like raising the zombie from the dead or something? Like what's going on here? During this part. <laughs> zombie. Are you and that I think is cute too. I love the little <laughs> It's cute. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> and I love the look of the little ghosts. Also, I didn't even realize she's got flowers in her eyes. She's a prankster persona with deep insights into life. Literally the greatest character ever. Really? She wants to bury Chi-Chi. Oh, she wants to put Chi-Chi to rest. Oh, so she's trying to kill the little zombie kid. Zombie. <laughs> she said, this guy... <laughs> I like her even more now. She said, we don't need any little kids in this game. Get back into the ground. <laughs> that's, 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 I like her. I like her. Hu Tao, I like her. Her trailer gets a like. I like her concept. I like her music. 10 out of 10. Liked everything about that. Fantastic. Oh, we could have just kept going with this. This is where the Venti English trailer came in. We already watched Venti, so we're going to skip that. Rosaria. No overtime. What is this? I complete my work with the utmost professionalism and effort. But when my shift is over, it's over. Just in time to enjoy a glass of breakfast wine? Few know that Rosaria, the unpredictable sister who did her best to avoid all the church's activities, is in fact very reliable in her work. But does anyone know what work Rosaria does? Okay, let's see. She's ice, thorny benevolent- Bruh! I know what kind of work she does! Hold on a minute! What's what's her OnlyFans? A sister of the church, though you wouldn't know it if it weren't for her attire. Known for her sharp, cold words and manner, she often works alone. Solo. Only. She sure does. Let's keep going, goth mommy. Okay. Element Cryo. Me? I'm just another ordinary person. No, you are Jewish not. Work. I just do what I have to do. No, you... Mm -mm. The sisters is worse than the next. If it's not about prayer, then it's about choir or some other thing I'm supposed to participate in. I'm trying to stay out of sight. Pray. I like her theme, too. Not for the gods nor the betterment of others, but for yourself. Yeah. Okay, so she attacks with the spear, too. The music's pretty good. Okay, what, what did she just do there? Okay, sending the spears down from the Shiver! Yo! Everything is negotiable except overtime. Everything's negotiable except well that was kind of short actually. She did a boa handcock kick. Kicked high kick into the sky and then bam! Right down into the ground. I I really like her design. A lot. I just do what I have to do. I like her. I also like the fact that she looks tired. She's like, she's done with the world. She says, look, I'm tired of all these people. <laughs> I'm not looking to work overtime. So that, so I'm wondering, are the sisters, is the church evil or something? Feel free to give me a little insight into the story. Like, what's going on here? What what's, what's going on here with the church? Are they like vampires or something? She is. She's genuinely done with the world. She should be a five star. She's just a nun who hates her job. Oh, so the church isn't evil then. Okay. Interesting. So she hates her job, so she wears fishnets. Okay, all right. <laughs> yeah, the churches are always evil in anime, so I had to just ask. Her voice kind of doesn't match, though. I don't mind it, but her voice doesn't really match to me. I really like her design, though. Yeah, neat. Okay, I like her. Her trailer could have been better, but I like her. All right, next one. I'll put my glasses back on. Here we go. The thing is, Roger, you just got to understand there's literally nothing going on with the church in this game. She started as an assassin and then got adopted by the church. If you listen to the Japanese trailer, she has an ara ara voice. All right, let's hear this. I got to hear this. Rosaria Japanese. Let's hear this. I got to hear this, obviously. I have to. Japanese dub with English sub. Okay, we got to hear this. Okay. We're going to watch it one more time in Japanese. This matches. This matches. She does straight up have a... Ara ara. <laughs> she does. Does she say it? That fits. That fits. That fits. Yeah, this is exactly what I pictured. Huh. 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 
Also, now that I'm listening to the music again, the music is pretty good. Yeah. She sounds like Boa. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Roger down horrendous. I'm not down horrendous. My girlfriend's literally in the other room. <laughs> she plays Genshin Impact. If I wanted to, I go Reagan, make a Rosaria cosplay. So, in fact, I'm up horrendous. You are the one down horrendous. <laughs> Let's keep going. Here we go. Yanfei, legal expert. Let's do this. The Japanese voice really was incredible, though. All right. Yanfei, legal expert. Oh, excuse me. Legal expertise. Only adhering to the law can the people solve life's myriad of problems. This young lady, a half-illuminated beast, is the top legal expert in the harbor. She knows the law inside and out, as well as how to balance it with human nature. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Um, by the way, Roger, you need to check out the Hu Tao Japanese trailer later on, too. I might. I'll do that at the ending. We'll go back and we'll listen to hers. All right, let's see this. Yanfei, legal expertise. She's also fire, so I hope she's cool. Because we already got one good fire character. Let's give me another one. Let's go. Let's hear this. Wit wise innocence. Oh, I kind of like her design. A My legal advisor. Top legal expert in Lila. Okay. Avoidance of doubt. No one else oh, I love her song, us. too. I'm fully versed in every area of the law. She's got the scales of conviction. The law can be both a help and a hindrance. <laughs> okay. I like her outfit a lot, actually. Only by adhering to the law can the people solve life's myriad of problems. Hmm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Incinerate! Okay, I thought she was... I thought for sure if she's a lawyer, she would go, OBJECTION! Anyway, my point is, you can always rely on me. Okay, I, I like her weapon more than anything else. Her weapon is really cool. Where's, where's her design again? Wait, the beginning. That weapon is awesome. The concept of, like, a justice spear with, like, this dragon on the end of it, and then the scales on the bottom, very cool. Yanfei is also currently uh, active on Banner. <laughs> I respect her as a law student. I love her, but some has a, have opposing feelings. She's a little smug? Really? A well-known legal advisor active in the harbor, a brilliant young lady whose veins runs a mixed blood of an illuminated beast. Okay, so I feel like her story is probably interesting too. And I really do like her outfit. Her outfit's cute. I like the little scrolls on it over here, a little bow. I like her. Pyro Yanfei. Wish her trailer was a little longer, but I like her. All right. Eula, the flickering candlelight. 22 million with the dance of a sinner. Oh, we got to watch this one. Okay. Eula, flickering candlelight. Let's go. This is going to be good. The tech otakus really are saving the world with this one. Dance of Sacrifice, Act 3. Flickering candlelight. Oh. Bro, like, <laughs> that's all. I don't even watch anymore. I like it. Dancer girl with Spanish guitar. This is it. This is it. Yes, 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 yes. And she's out. Yes. The spin drift night. She fights by dancing. It's time. It's time. Instant like. Yes, 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 yes. I need to pull oh, do her music! This the music oh. of a ceremony for Oh, and you can add an instrumental in the background? Yeah, just a private With pattern. the harmonies? Oh! Mmm! Yes, 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 yes! Be mine. The glacial seal. Once a symbol of Lawrence Pride. All, and she's got the, the bear back with the okay yes and she's cryo mm. see they're going all out we're saying let's give her a dance number shutter <laughs> rack and ruin rack and ruin okay oh what was that she had a little bit of a Are you here to spy on me? Amber's like all the rest uh, of us. No, I was just worried you might be in trouble. No, you weren't. Not yet. It takes two to tango. Yo, what? Uh, huh? The 
their girlfriends? If I could leave double like, I would leave double like. I would leave double likes. She's an ice dancer with Spanish guitar theme and she's dating Amber? That's a, that's a fat W. That is the fattest W so far. Yes, 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 yes. Dude, this whole portion of the beginning? I just want to read what it says. Her art is also awesome. Captain, wait, 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 wait. Captain of the Knights of Favonius Reconnaissance Company. Oh, I thought for a second it was going to be like she's in the theater troupe or something. And then I'd be like, that would be a triple like. <laughs> that would be a triple like. Chris, uh, Chris Wong, by the way, super chatted and said, Roger, just so you know, everything from the Hoyos, uh, from the Hoyoverse is copyright free. Really? So basically I can go and listen to any of the music and they won't copyright strike me. All the more reason to stop watching anime and to start playing Genshin. <laughs> I, I like her a lot. She's one of the best so far. I really like her. I like everything about her. That is a yes. Eula, yes. Next one. Ka okay, I'm, not, I'm just going to wait. Wandering Winds. Here we go. Kazuha. Let's see this one. Man, I'm loving this so far. I'm having a good time going through all of these. This is this next one is HMK's favorite character. Okay. In the setting sun. He's a poet. Okay. And the last one. I love what they're doing with. Oh, yo! He pulled a Luffy in the Return to Stop Odi arc. Too slow. Oh, okay. Dude, his theme is awesome. Oh, there's a pipe. Is there lyrics? Did it go? Work, work. Mm. Oh, he's remixing the trailer? Mmm. <laughs> the silhouette. Oh, I like this. You're really going to trust me, despite my being from Inazuma. My mind is like a wind on the waves. It can change in an instant. I like that he's got a flair for the dramatic. Kid, I think I got you figured out. <coughs> oh, in that case. <coughs> Who? <laughs> Who is this? <coughs> <laughs> oh my god. Who is this? Is this the pirate girl? <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you saw this okay, I was I wasn't expecting that. What? You mean these amateurs? <laughs> I was saving them for you. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, I love too that all of his attacks have like the the leaf flare. What? What is it? How is he summoning his sword? Wait, there's a lot in this trailer. Dude! Oh, my last line. Stirs the drifter's Stirs heart. The drifter's heart. This man really met a pirate lady and took the trailer to write his poem. First off, this is getting to like the aesthetic of this one. Excuse me. Phenomenal. I got to catch my breath after that bridge scene. All right, hold on. This is also a gorgeous shot with the sunset and everything. That that scene is awesome with the arrow. I want to read what this says. Also, his design is awesome with the autumn leaves on it and the samurai sword that's glowing. A wandering samurai from Inazuma who's currently part of Liu's crew fleet. A gentle and carefree soul whose heart hides a great many burdens from the past. So this dude probably has an awesome story then too. Yeah, this whole thing, it seemed like an old school Japanese movie and it's got the like modern instrumentals with the classic Japanese instrumentals too. I love it. So what is, is he wind? He's wind. Dude, yeah, the theming in this one was fantastic. I really enjoyed this one. Kazuha. This right here too, hold on, wait. This is what I wanted to see, wait, 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 wait. Cause he whips around. Fallen leaves, adorn 
and my knights. When you get this shot of the two of them back to back, I want to know what he does with his weapon. Because he holds it, he spins it, and then it, like, disappears. That is, that is style right there. That's how you get rid of your sword. You don't even sheathe it. You're just like, I'm done. Spin it midair, and it disappears. Yep, that's a like for me. That one's a like for me. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. That was cool. And then it ends with this poem. I liked it. Great like all the way around. The drip. Fantastic. Kami Sato is next. Here we go. Kami Sato. Camellia in winter snow. Another ice girl then. Okay. Let's see. Is your honor embodied. Your will revealed. Okay. Oh, I like. Mine must be pure. I like what they're doing with this one too. When you strike, be quick as lightning. I feel like there's more ice characters than anybody else in this game. There are so many ice characters. Okay. Blade and sees victory in a single motion, too perfect to be parried. I feel like she's got some hardcore fans for sure. I have long desired to learn the blade work of another land. Okay. May, I would like to spar with you. Master of she got a fan? Okay. Daughter of the Kamisato clan, dignified and elegant as well as wise and strong. Okay. Mm hmm. Bum 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 bum. You guys know I don't like straight across bangs. So already it's not a like for me. I know that's weird, but it is what it is. But I do like the aesthetic of the trailer and I do think it's very pretty. Oh, this is cool. Take flight. I could I could see how she could potentially be a fan favorite though. For sure. I got people in my chat saying best girl. Okay. She's got style and grace, I'll give her that. For sure. And she's got a little bit of a short sword too, which is interesting. Lady, your form is as flawless as ever. Oh, is that a uh, Tachibana? Uh oh, wait a minute. My <laughs> my camera fell. Hold on a minute. What just happened there? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> my camera clearly likes this dude. <laughs> What's going on here? What happened there? My camera was like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Who is this? Hold on. Let me adjust this. What happened there? All right. Clearly, my camera was thirsting. All right. Are we good? Are we back to normal? We're good. We're good. Okay, the camera died from seeing Toma. <laughs> Toma's best waifu. <laughs> the camera is down bad indeed. The camera's down bad for Toma. That's exactly right. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta, let me, give me a quick second to adjust this. Hold on. This is fun, this is fun. I'm glad I chose to do this today. I'm really having a good time watching all these trailers. This is a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. The camera is instant dead after Best House Husband. This is her BF. The camera must cope and seethe. <laughs> All right, hold on. I'm going to move this over a little bit more. Wait a second. There we go. There we go. Are we good? Now we're back to normal now. We're back to normal now. Okay, it's even. We're good. Everything's squared away. Here we go. So no one gets injured? Oh, was I heading too hard? <sighs> I recognize her voice actress too, but... I don't know from what. Before the traveler arrives, spar with me some more. As you wish, my lady. That's cute, I though. I do not know the traveler's skill with a blade. I'm a sucker for like playable couples in games. I always think that's cute. Especially in a game like Genshin, where you're playing with other people, where you definitely want like two people. I like that. That's cute. That was cute. I like that one. All right, Seiyu is next. You who art. Mujina Escape. 6.4 million views. All right, let's see this. Seiyu. All right, let's try this. Recon confirms. No sign of the shrine meeting within a three-mile radius. <sighs> that time... The child assassin? A windy day is a good day for a getaway. Reusing Klee's running animation, too. <laughs> That's... Okay. 
Oh, she's a Tanuki. That's kind of cute. The music's pretty good too. It's got the like chiptune stuff in there. The outfit's funny. She's in like a Kigurumi <laughs> and has a Tanuki tail. But okay. Rolling around like Sonic the Hedgehog? Wait, so I missed it. Is she water or wind? I'll, I'll go back and click at the beginning. What was what was the element of this one? Where was the uh, the element? Here we go, here we go. Element, oh, wind. Okay, so she's wind. She was wind. That's actually a cute outfit, though. It's got the little tanuki leaf on it, too. I like that. I just, I had enough of these kids. I don't really like the kid characters. All right, we're moving on. Yoimiya is the next one. Dazzling lights in summer. Okay, here we go. Yoimiya. Hey, Pops, rise and shine. Oh, cool, she's like a... Oh, oh, what's her name? What's her name from Sakura Wars? Oh, what's her name? It's gonna bother me now. The red-headed girl in Sakura Wars. Oh, I like her. Owner of the fireworks stand, the queen of the summer festival. Okay. Pew pew? Really? <laughs> okay. All right. They know what they're doing with this character. They know what they're doing. <laughs> and the fun. Oh, I like the aesthetic as well with the comic look. Okay. I like her a lot. Yo, Mia? Oh, cute. Do you want to go to the Hanabi Festival with me? Who's this? Her boyfriend? We're sharing this moment, looking at the beautiful fireworks in the night sky, together, beautiful, forever. Like that. Uh oh. Oh, she's gonna kill him? Oh, I like the little anime cut in too. Best of She burned that poor guy alive. Oh, there's the little ninja girl. So they're buddies? Don't even think about getting in the way next time. I love the little, the flourish at the ending. The dun da 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 dun da 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 dun dun da da. There's more to the trailer though. More useful. You could try wearing something a little more fun and festive, or pretend to be ghosts to entertain the kids. You know, liven up the atmosphere. I can't just. Uh, Yoi Mia, they've already run off. Huh? Hey, I wasn't done talking. I didn't run off. You can keep talking. That's fine. I didn't run off. <laughs> I wanted to read the rest of what it said when they introduced her. Hold on, because I missed this. Frolicking flames, Yoi Mia. Her artwork is incredible too. Her artwork looks really, really cute. Owner of the Nagano Hara Fireworks, known as the Queen of the Summer Festival, her, oh, excuse me, she excels in her craft of creating fireworks that symbolize people's hopes and dreams. I like her a lot. I like her a lot. And she's a cool fire character. Why would you ever use Amber then? She's a fire archer girl. You, you just get her and you never use Amber ever again. Amber goes in the box. Never to be used. Like the like the HM character that you get in the beginning of a game in every Pokemon game. You just never use Amber again. You just use Yo, uh, Yoimiya with her little fireworks. That's it. Roger, that's the thing. You're already learning you don't use Amber. People don't use Amber. You are correct. She was the Amber killer. And she was released on Amber's birthday? That's rough, buddy. That is rough. She was released on Amber's birthday? Did they just... Why? Do people just really hate Amber that much? And for what reason? I liked Amber when we were playing the game. I liked her. Alright, Kujo Sara is the next one. Thunderous Devotion. Let's see this. Kujo Sara. 7 million views. Okay. To strike your Another archer girl. Okay. Mind, arrow, and bow. Listen, thunder speaks the will of the almighty Shogun. Okay. 
The duty of a Tengu warrior is to watch over the mm. mountains and forests. Mm. While that of the Kujo clan is to guard Inazuma. I actually really like her outfit, too. I have agreed to fight by your side, and I will honor that commitment. Okay. On my watch, Inazuma will always be defended, and the will of the Shogun mm. will always be done. Show me the cut-in. Ooh! She's very precise. It's just like one and done. Yeah, yeah, Flash. yeah, yeah. Flash! Oh, she can teleport? Okay. Storm the front. And she could summon lightning down like Thor? To manifest eternity per the almighty Shogun's will. Oh, I like her that wings. I to. Interesting. Okay, I like her. She's a neat character. Raiden is next. You're not ready for the next one? Raiden. Okay, well, let's see. Let's see. I liked, I liked her, but let's see. If everyone's hyping up Raiden. Warning, this video contains flashes of light that may trigger discomfort in patients with epilepsy. Viewers are advised to watch with caution. Okay, good to know. So this is like the Porygon episode of Pokemon. So that warning is for my chat, too. If you're epileptic, skip this part of the video. Okay, here we go. Raiden, oh, so they, oh, this is who she works for then. The girl we just watched, Sarah, she works for Raiden. Raiden Shogun, the judge, okay. Two and a half minute long trailer, so this must be one of the best ones. That's Yaimiko, right, the publishing house girl? In the land of the Narukami, centuries pass without change. Okay. Deep in the heart of the city stands the lofty abode of the Raiden Shogun. Mm. She looks down upon her realm. Bum, 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 bum. Look at her waters. castle. So that's. And sees oh, her yeah. Oh, <laughs> See, Reagan has cosplayed as her before. Relatively recently, I took photos of Reagan cosplaying as her. And I liked her design. Trivial yearning and petty passion. Trivial yearning and petty passion. They vanish like a mist, but the Shogun pursues. Okay, she floats. Wow, her theme. Eternity. They're hyping her up. Yo! Only through return. Oh my gosh! To the heavenly principles. Wow! The style, the drift. Oh! Oh! Lightning is eternal. The world is but shadow. Oh! Dude, the, the, the style can only survive with an underlying. I reality. love her voice too. Reality is the stillness buried deep beneath the illusion. Bum bum bum. This is eternity. Ah! To oblivion. She yanked that out of her boobs. She has her sword tucked away in her boobs. Are you kidding me? They knew what they were doing. Yo, the trick the way it flips like this! Stop! I need to pull her. I need to pull her. She's awesome! Like, not even from a cutie patootie aesthetic, like, she looks awesome to fight as. Summoning lightning down from the sky and summoning swords and she has a giant castle? And you got the hip-hop music with the Japanese theming? Oh, yes. This is top tier waifu material right here. You seem woven from the stuff of dreams. All shall fade away. I love her voice too. I love her voice. I want to real quickly when they when they go to the character cut in. I think it was right over here, right after she, right here. I want to see what this says here. Closest to the heavenly principles. Mm, that beat is incredible. I'm sure somebody out there has done like a nerdcore. Genshin Impact rap or something to that beat. Raiden Shogun the Plane. Her Excellency the Almighty Narukami Ogosho promised the people of Inazuma an unchanging eternity. Yo. That, like, dude, the, the little after effects that are being played there. And she's a sword fighter, she's not an archer. Oh, she's a spear user, never mind. Lightning is eternal. The world is Dude! Shadow. Mm. 
Watch it twice because it's so nice. And I love that that little Fantasy. inner cut. This is a like. This is a like. This is a like for sure. This is a like. How many likes have I done so far? Six? We'll check at the end of this. Is the stillness buried deep beneath the illusion? Yeah, this is this is an all-time great one. I really, 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 really like this one. I like right in a lot. She's just cool! And I love that she yanks the sword out of her boobs. That's so great. But she's badass! Like, I really I like her a lot. See now, Reagan, I know you're in the chat right now. I appreciate the fact that you cosplay her now. I have a greater appreciation for your cosplay of her. I really do. Yeah, this is awesome. She's got easily one of the best trailers. Where the lightning's coming out of the ground and the crow comes back in. This was this one was great. I enjoyed it the first time. I even almost watched the whole thing through the second time. Enjoyed her. Very cool. You gotta make the sword next then. See, there you go. You can make the sword to pair with the outfit. There you go. Right in Shogun, she got one of the likes. Six likes so far. We should actually do like a running tally real quick. Let's go to YouTube. Let's go to my library and let's look at likes real quick. Liked videos. I want to see this. So far we did Raiden Shogun, Kazuha, Yula, Hutao, Zhongli, and Venti, and Klee. Ironically enough, Klee was the first like. Which is weird, considering I hopped out of that video the second she was like... <laughs> it was shown that she was a little kid. I like all of them. I like all of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I like these. Maybe I should only reserve three more to make a top ten. Maybe I should only reserve three more. And I also have the right to revoke a like if we get more than that. But I think I want to leave it in the top ten. We don't have many more left to go either. We only have like seven more to go from this point. Oh, eight more to go from this point. So let's see. Sango no Mia Kokomi. A thousand waves under the moon. Okay. Let's see. 1080p. All right. Let's do this. I'll move this out of the way. Okay, Little Mermaid Girl. Okay. Pretty music. When smaller fish gather together, they can act as one body for the protection of all. This is how the weak mount their resistance. Okay. There's no description. Oh no, the divine priestess of Watatsumi Island. Oh wait, wait, wait. Yeah, she is literally a fish girl. Hold on. All of the island's affairs are at this young lady's fingertips. Oh, are those fins or is that just her dress? I like her aesthetic. It's very calming. Rest and rebuild. Okay. Okay. Our ancestors once dwelt in the dark ocean depths. Very pretty trailer. Felt when they first gazed upon the starry sky. Thinking of that moment makes me cherish the precious light I mm. see now. Billowing search. Yeah, I like her aesthetic, I do. But I feel like there's other water characters that I would use. I want to use the surfing water guy that we saw earlier. I forgot what his name was. I feel like Regan would like this girl. Oh, she's a, a really good healer? One of the best, if not the best healer in the game. Really? Okay. She's got a little bit of a Yuna thing going on, too. Tartaglia, that's what I was thinking of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Roger, if you double check, there is a trailer missing from this for Shen He. Oh, there's no Shen He in there? I'll look her up right now. Hold on. Shen He. Let's see. Open this up. Shen He character demo. Shout out to all the viewers in here right now, too. This is incredible. Shen He character demo. Character teaser or character demo? Where is the character demo? Look at all these reactions. Oh, my God. The problem with Shen He? Huh? Character demo, Shen He, where is she? Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go, okay. Five months ago. Oh, so she's pretty new then. Wow, wow, so we're into 2022 characters already then. 
So the next character over here, oh, Toma from the trailer for the little, oh, no, no, October. Okay, so we'll, we're gonna do this in order. We're doing Shen He when we get to that point. So Toma's next. Okay, so we're gonna do Toma next. All right, thank you for letting me know though. Okay, Toma's first. Here we go. The way I see it, housekeeping is a unique skill set. Cleaning, cooking, and mending are among my greatest strengths. Okay. He's I a house husband. Inazuma originally. I took a boat all the way here from Mondstadt. Inazumans are definitely more particular about etiquette than Mondstatters. Okay. On that note, if you ever want my lady's opinion, you may have to coax it out of her. She's so polite, she doesn't always speak her mind. He likes dogs. People he would do well on Tinder. Focused on other people's weaknesses tend to expose their own weaknesses pretty easily. Protect, uh, what, what, what? Hold on, wait, let me go back real quick. What'd that say? Protect her from armor? To expose their own Yeah, protector from, oh, protector from afar, excuse me. A Kamisato clan housekeeper, a well-known fixer in an Azuma. There you go. So he, yeah, he's literally the maid for the other girl we saw. Okay. Check this out. I'm sure a lot of people like him. <laughs> Supporting fire. Hmm. We go for a nice meal sometime. My treat, of course. Sure thing. We'll go to a steakhouse. You buy me a steak. Fantastic. I'll hang out with you, Toma. You seem cool. All right. Next up is Goro from December 10th. Okay, so the next one after this is going to be Shen He then. If this is January 3rd. This was December 10th. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me go back. Goro. Okay, here we go. The ever victorious pointy ear general. The key to seizing victory in battle lies in remembering Mikote? the meaning of battle and employing the right tactics to generate momentum, making your forces unstoppable. With momentum on our side and close camaraderie, <laughs> his little ears twitching. <laughs> general Goro of the Watatsumi Island Resistance, ready okay. and waiting. Canine warrior. <laughs> oh my God, they're like, look at the ear effects. <laughs> oh, I like his his song. Fall in. He's got a little paw print thing. That's cute. Hanging out with the main character. His eyeballs have little paw prints in them. This guy's boss is actually the fish girl you just you watched. Oh! This is a victory that belongs to the both of us. His trailer was kind of short. Some of these trailers, I don't know, some of them are like three minutes long and some of them are like a minute. Not even. Gives me very Sonic Unleashed vibes and Xenoblade-esque music. Roger, just keep in mind that Ito's trailer has spoilers in it. Like I'm gonna even know what half the thing in the trailer means. I don't particularly care. I'm sure by the time I get to the Ito in the game and I play as Ito, I'm gonna forget everything from the trailer, so don't even worry about it. I'm not worried about spoilers in Genshin Impact videos, because again, I'm not gonna remember anything. I've literally played three hours of this game. I am a very, very new player of Genshin Impact, so I'm not particularly worried. Um, oh, Goro's a four-star, which is why they're a short trailer. The four-star ones are shorter and basic. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, so then next up, oh, Ito's the next day. December 11th, Arataki Ito, make way for the one and Oni. We had an Oni general? Let's see this. Arataki Ito. Okay. Turned it back up to 1080p. So this is Ito. Oh, come on. Oh. The vision hunt decree is over. <laughs> His design's cool. Okay. Okay. Start at the top. This guy's full force, oh, Inuyasha. Beautiful vision. I know you're up there. Oh, I, yeah. the voice is, um... <laughs> this is Haida, isn't it? From Magretzko? If you want to take my vision, you're going to need a lot oh, no! more people. Oh, no, 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 this is Max. This is Max Middleman. This is my guy. Wait, what happened? Why did it replay the trailer? Wait, 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 wait. Wait, what, 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 what? What happened there? Why did it go to the next one? Want to take my vision? You're gonna need a lot more people. Oh, 
This is Max, isn't it? I'm yeah, this Ito. is. This is Saitama from One Punch Man. Max is my guy. Awesome. All right. Now it's showtime. The first and greatest head of the Arataki gang. Okay. I like him. Oh, cool effect there. Man, so how... Oh, I love the horns in there, too. Kujo Sara is coming. <laughs> Run away. Okay, so he's against Kujo Sara, so they're no kids. rivals. Time to show you what it is that makes my gang stick around. I love that. The awesome oh, boom, putting the. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, I love that. With the horns in the back. He's got the giant Oni club. He'd fit right in with the Beast Pirates in One Piece. Yeah, I like him a lot. Breaking rocks with his bare fist. Nice of you to join us, General Cujo. Are you here to make me beg for mercy too? Final <laughs> warning. I feel like they'll probably end up now, together. Arataki Ito. They're on opposite sides of history, but. Oh, but General, if you join the Arataki gang, nah, I think they're gonna like each other. I'll show you what dreams are made of. He said, "I could show you what dreams are made of." See, there you go. Vision back. I'm gonna show her. Boss. Her vision back. Wait, what? I'm sorry. That was all what? his head? <laughs> uh, boss, I think this might be yours. Way down here. <laughs> He's got that little anime oh, aggravated effect, too. Okay, I'm, coming, I'm coming up there. <laughs> that was cute. That was cute. That was cute. That was cute. Thinking back to his past. <laughs> That's cute. I liked him. This. I liked him a lot. Yours. I like him a lot. So apparently, the chat is saying that this is a ship. That the two of them are a ship. So people agree with me that they like each other. That Okay. I kind of like them. Because she's very, you know, stoic. You know, well put together. She's got the little... I like the two of them. I like the two of them. And he's more wild style. I love his design, too. With the club and the tattoos and everything. He seems neat. I would not be upset if I pulled him. I like him. Alright, next one is... Yoon Jin. All right, so Shen He is after Yoon Jin then. Okay. Yoon Jin. Oh, man, we only have a few more to go. The true meaning of opera. I think, wait a minute. This is the singer girl, I think, that we saw in the, um, when we did, like, the character breakdowns in, in my stream. I think I know who this is. The true meaning of opera. Okay. Let's see this. My name is Yoon Jin. Such a pleasure to finally meet you, and I'd be honored to have you attend a performance sometime. Okay, a renowned opera singer. The Yunhan Opera Troupe has been under my leadership for quite mm. some time. Okay, I like her music. Life mirrors opera, just as opera reflects life. It's what I truly dun, 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 dun. And it's what I will be pursuing for the rest of so my So I'm wondering, life. if you go to that area in the game, is she just Many performing on stage if you're not using her? Stories of gods and the adepti. So most mm, operas mm, focus mm, on mm, the supernatural, mm. too. But in this age of humanity, I would rather like to tell stories about ordinary people. I began my training in the art of the sphere, hoping to enhance my performance in stage combat. In stage combat? I stuck with it, hoping to master the techniques of self-defense. I believe I've got... I started the using now. the sphere to make my plays Dear better, and now I can actually kill people. Look at that. <laughs> and step. I like her... I like her a lot, actually. Observe. Flags up. I'm assuming that, like, boosts her attack or something? I love her theme. <laughs> the subtitle said, oh, maestro, but instead she just went, meow. <laughs> She's cute. I like her. Yoon Jin. I like her. All right, okay, so Yai Miko is February, so now we watch Shen He. Okay, I already know this is probably going to be a like. I'm going to tell you right now, probably going to be a like because I liked this girl when we first saw her way back in the um, in our first gameplay stream. So I think I'm going to like this girl. Shen He. Hers is a two and a half minute trailer, so she must be a five star. Okay, let's see this. Make sure it's 1080p for Shen He. Okay, here we go. But I have a feeling this is going to be a like. I have a feeling this is going to be a like. Halt! 
Oh, and so that's her nephew that we pulled on the previous stream. This Poor little wizard. Activity. It was all you're doing. This ends now. Okay. Oh, dude. This is Shiva. She's literally Shiva. Oh, my God. Demons are masters of deception. That's a like. Never let guard. <laughs> I knew it! I knew it was gonna happen! Shen He, an adept disciple with the most unusual air, having spent much time cultivating in the mountains, she's every bit as cool and adepty as them. Like her, love her design, like that she's ice, love her outfit. Yes. And she's got this cool, like. Unleash! She's able to summon like little ice versions of herself and walk on water. Oh yeah. Transfiguration. That's so cool that it's got the little, oh man. It's no use. No use. Shen, he's gonna put you down. They're hyping this up too in the trailer. Mind be purged, world be saved. Okay. Are those playing cards? Cryo what was incarnate. that? Cryo incarnate. Dude. Random cutting of a crane? <laughs> this is actually fun not knowing what's going on. Oh, cool. Oh, I love what they're doing there. Oh, push the thing out of the way and then... Wow! The brutality! Activity is an omen of impending disaster. Perhaps Master was right. She is one of the all-time best. For, for sure. I see for you're sure. Also an adept exorcist. Some of your techniques look quite familiar. So I'm wondering. Uh, I am Shen He. I run Shen He. You needn't worry about me. Oh, uh, but you, uh, your temperature uh, seems unusually high. I love, I love her voice. I love her voice. My popsicle. I almost forgot. My I, popsicle. Wait. Shen <laughs> Wait, so you're my... You're my auntie? <laughs> auntie Shen -ha. Okay. Here's what I gotta do, though, for Shen -ha. I gotta do this. Shen -ha, Japanese. Clearly, look at this. Number one search term. Shen -ha, Demo Japanese. We're doing this. Watching this again. We are watching this one again. 1080p. Here we go. This game really does have awesome character designs. I actually kind of prefer her English, to be honest with you. I kind of prefer her English. Hold on, I want to skip to the part of the ending where they're talking. The crane in the wild. She's... I've heard her in something before. I, it's weird, though. I kind of like the English voice better. Oh, the logo's different in Japanese? I didn't know that. Saiba? Saber? Funny to see my favorite reaction guy discovering Genshin for the first time. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Saber from what? From what is that? Excalibur Saber? What is that? Oh, from Fate. Oh, I don't I don't watch Fate. I don't watch Fate, and so I don't I know nothing about it. So I would have gone completely past me. Sorry. But I love her design, and she obviously still got the like, so it is what it is. Alright. Third up. Three from the end. This is it. Yaimiko, Kamisato, and Yalan are the last three. When you get to her in the story, you're going to love her? I'm excited. All right. Yaimiko. Now, I know already that I like Yaimiko because, once again, like I said multiple times in the stream, Regan is the voice actress for one of her employees. So I, I'm already going to know a little bit going into this trailer. All right. Here we go. 1080p. Yaimiko, the antidote for a divine kitsune guji. All right. Let's see this. Let's see this. I love her area too. I then found myself reborn as Guji Yai. <laughs> Me 
Sipping shrine maidens in sacred matters. So like. <laughs> Sipping tea and kneeling in solemn oh, meditation. I'm glad I, I liked it early, but I still like the aesthetic and of the trailer, so that's fine. To listen to shrine visitors. Enough. Oh, this won't do. We're making a light novel here, not a dry documentary. Not a dry documentary. And honestly, <laughs> I like her. Do you really think I lead such a boring existence? I like her. Hmm? Uh, no, not at all, Ikuchi. <laughs> That's chief editor to you. Chief editor. Ah, uh, yes, chief editor. <laughs> a light novel begins with pure imagination. For example. I like everything about her. I must say. I love the aesthetic of the trailer too. That it looks like they're off of pages from a book. Oh, oh! Astute. Wait, 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 wait. Astute amusement. Her character art goes hard, man. Astute amusement. Lady Guji of the Grand Narakami Shrine also serves as editor in chief of the Eye Publishing House. Unexpected intelligence and cunning are hidden under her beautiful appearance. Beautiful indeed. Let's go. I love the cherry blossoms. Mmm. Mmm. Summoning down the lightning, she's got some earrings. I love her design. <laughs> they know what they're doing with this trailer. They know what they're doing. Straight up. I, I respect it though. I respect it. Mihoyo, I respect it. I respect it. You know. It's gonna get people to buy the game. The little laugh and the walked into mine. I'm always watching. Bro, what? She has like an evil electric form. Yo, she looks cooler like that. Sight to behold. Drop the little flower petals. Okay. <laughs> I admit defeat. Just do it. Exercise, Exercise me. me. <laughs> Exercise you? But I thought you weren't ready to return to the cycle. Uh-oh. So first, let me show you what a cruel world this can be. Oh, no. I love the glow of the red eyes. Oh, it's so graphic. You never really do something like that. No, would you? never. I would never. <laughs> it's not like I wrote this. Splendid. The... <laughs> what when is the reader starts what asking that question, you know you've written a good one. <laughs> Her books are nonfiction. That's what I picked up from this trailer. Is she's off murdering people under the moonlight sky and then writing books about it. This is really cute, though. I love this little whatever this is. Her and Raiden Shogun are besties? Really? That also explains the electric powers, too. Oh, also, yeah, because that's right. Because in Raiden's trailer, she sends off the message with the crow. That's right. So they're best friends. All right. Let me tell you about my best friend. Well, I like them both. I like them both. All right. Kami Sato Ayato is next. Fathomless swirls in the forest. Kami Sato Ayato. I like his name. March 28th, so this is very recent then. All right, let's see this. Oh, two and a half minutes long, so this is another five star. Okay. Do not expose your identities. Like his voice already. A signal before you act. Yes, sir. Roger, get ready for the best Hydro character in the game, really? Grand festivals like this monopolize the Tenryo Commission's resources. So while they were watching the fireworks display in the other trailer, this was going on. Pity you were all they sent. Let's go for a stroll. We wish to discuss cooperation. Whoa, who is who is who is this? I'm assuming this is a no-name character. But she's got a cool design. A humble suggestion. The Fatui would do well to update their intelligence concerning me. Ah, but of course. Okay. That would require one of you to return in one piece. He said it, one piece, he said it. <laughs> the young but highly accomplished head of the Yashiro Commission's Kamisato clan, cultured and polite, a man of many ways and means, the pillar of fortitude, Kamisato Ayato. The name also slaps. 
Soon. Cascade. Hmm. It almost kind of reminds me of like a Naruto ending theme. I like his movement too, that he just kind of teleports all over the place. You underestimate your foe. <laughs> if assassinating me was that simple, I can name a few rival clans who would have had an easier time over the years. Okay. Hamisato mm. Art. Suiyu. I like his aesthetic. He's very calculated, very smooth. A steady blade. My cool. Lord, we failed to protect you. <laughs> I do not keep the Shumatsuban for the trivial matter of dealing with assassins. Uh, trivial? So, he wiped them all out. What's the situation? Uh, the operation went smoothly. The resistance platoon is hidden near Tenshikaku. Oh, so they're at war? Forgive me, sir. Oh, there's the little ninja kid in the back. Taking this level of risk, it seems out of character. Let's just say, I'm doing a small favor for my sister. Interesting. Okay. Interesting. So then I am curious, chat. Oh. Oh, he's Ayaka's brother. Oh. Okay, interesting. I kind of want to know more about him. Ayaka's his sister. Yeah. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. He had a cool aesthetic, though. I liked his aesthetic. And we're on the last one now. This is it. I'm going to be all caught up. Yolan, this is it. May 20... So this is, like, recent, too. This was a couple days ago. This was two weeks ago they added this character. By the way, Roger, good thing to know. Kamisato likes boba tea. That is good to know. <laughs> All right. It's late. The residents sleep peacefully behind closed doors, listening to the pitter-patter of the heavy rain. Those fond of traveling at such times are either ill-intentioned or secretly pursuing the former. It doesn't matter who wins or loses. The rain will wash away all traces either way. When the dawn breaks and the sky clears, the mysterious guest would have been gone already, without a soul noticing. Yolan, shadow in the rain, 2 minutes, 45 seconds, this is going to be a good one to end on then. I'm glad we're not ending with a 4 star, this is good. This is very, very good. I'm ready for this. Yolan, shadow in the rain, 3, 2, and then I'll be all caught up, which is fantastic. And then I'll actually be able to play and pull for my favorite trailers. Alright, 3, 2, 1, go. Shadow in the rain. Leaving the city? It's a real jungle out there. They say there's this group of guys mm. who always come out in the rain. I like the it piano. It out the cries for help and washes away any sign of a struggle. Hmm. That all sounds perfect. She's a gambling lady? Oh, I love the noir <laughs> you music! Have nerves of steel, man. Ooh! You hear the... The quiet Ooh, Stop. in no, the background too. Guns. Bandits! Uh, help! Help! Mm. Been waiting long. <gasps> Love her voice. I figured. Love her design. Well, waiting game is over. She's a gambling girl. Oh my god! Oh my god! The aesthetic. A mysterious person who claims to work for the Ministry of Civil Affairs is a non-entity on the Ministry of Civil Affairs list. Valley Orchid Yalan. So she's a Vegas showgirl who throws magical dice? Oh, her theme already. Oh, it's got the jazz. Mm. Oh, the lights. Oh, yeah, her style's my kind of style. Dude, oh, I love the dip. Oh, man. Mm. That is smooth. Smooth as butter. Gotcha. Mmm. Mm. Makes me want to go watch Kakegurui. Dude, I love her outfit. Uh. 
What? Someone revealed my plans to you in advance, and you didn't think to run. She fights with strings too. She's like Doflamingo. Flamingo. What can I say? Much obliged. I love her design and aesthetic and music. I love this dude with the stage and the lights. <laughs> oh. Okay, I need her. I surrender. Please let me go. I have to pull You'll her. Never see me again. Oh, so now you're afraid. Oh, I'm sorry, but this is too. She's gonna too crack late. his neck with the string. No, wait. I know who gave you away. I'll tell you. No, I I'll take you to them myself. <laughs> Smart decision. Get up. <laughs> Chop, chop. She's scary. Friends, a little visit. I actually really like her haircut too. It reminds me of Lusamine. Oh, do oh, and the oh, the jazz ending. Oh, I liked her a lot. You could also pull her right now. Really? Hold on, real quick. Someone said to check out the character teaser for Yolan as well. Teaser Yolan. So I'll do this. Character teaser this. This is only a minute and 30 seconds, so I figure I might as well watch this. Please, have mercy. See, we've told you everything we know. <sighs> Scram, it's not you. I'm I like that they're using the 2D art for this as well. <laughs> By now, she'll be preoccupied with the treasure hoarders. Wow, this teaser's got There's really cool looking animation. That group. They should keep her off our trail for a good week or two. What? What? She like? To deal with. There's no way she can teleport? We'll have ample time to oh, was that like a camouflage thing? Uh, who's there? Uh, 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 where am I? How did I? Sorry. I know this isn't the farewell party you were hoping. Dude! Sin of the desk like the Godfather? You. She's top five, easy. My intelligence network doesn't stop operating just because I leave the city. I know all about the little Dude. games you've been playing. I'm afraid the fact that I'm back means my patience has run out. This makes me want to play the game so bad. Along with it. Like I said, I've only played like three hours at this point. I don't know how long it's going to get to the point where you get to her though. But I think I'm going to have to play. I got to play more. I definitely got to play more. Uh, I would say definitely end with the Tevat chapter preview. Tevat storyline chapter preview should be the last thing to react to today. Make sure to watch the Trayvot storyline preview. That's what you guys are saying. Okay. Thank you to all the new subscribers, by the way, during the stream today. This is fantastic. Clearly, you guys want more Genshin from me. If you haven't already, I will say this before we watch this last little bit. If you have not already, make sure to check out this Genshin video that I did last week. Today's stream is not sponsored, by the way. I saw people asking if this is sponsored. Even though this video is sponsored, this stream is not sponsored. I just liked it so much that I'm doing this, and you guys clearly enjoyed it too. But if you haven't already, make sure to check out this Genshin Impact video. I'll put a link to it in this video as well. Um, yeah, this is fantastic. Did I Also, did I leave a like on the Yulan trailer? Because I definitely meant to. Okay, I definitely meant to. I'm leaving a like on that one for sure. Um, also, real quick, before we watch this character teaser, clearly... These were the 10 that I liked the most in terms of character trailers. Yalan, Yaimiko, Shenhe, Raiden, Kazuha, Yula, Hutao, Zhongli, Venti, and oddly enough, Klee. And then I would say of these 10, the five I really want to pull would be Yalan, Yaimiko, Shenhe, Raiden, And then it's a toss-up between Zhongli, Hu Tao, and Yula. I'm going to be honest. I kind of, I think I want to pull Hu Tao. I like the weird, creepy funeral aesthetic. I like that she's a fire character. And there's a lot of Electro ones and Cryo ones and stuff. And Yula's a Cryo, isn't she? So I kind of feel like I want to pull Hu Tao. I like all 10 of these, though. I really do. I like all 10 of these. Zhang Li also seems amazing. All right, let's watch this character preview. You, what is this? What's the character name again? Tevat. Tevat. K. 
Character preview. All right, let's see this. Oh, chapter preview, excuse me. Revealed for next year, huge spoilers. Okay, whoa, 16 million views? Is this the video? Tevat storyline preview? This one. Make sure to watch the English dub. We had no time to see. Okay, this is English, this is English, this is English. This is the video, okay. We're ending with this. Tevat chapter storyline preview. Travail, contains spoilers, okay. We're watching right now, because again, I'm not going to remember any of this, so this is fine. The only thing I'm going to remember are the characters and their traits. I'm not going to remember the story stuff. So I'm just going to absorb it and watch it right now. Here we go. We Tevat chapter storyline. So let's not call I'm assuming this is going to have amazing music in it if you guys want me to react to it. Oh yeah, already it does. The war has already begun. It is just a continuation of past battles. The gods goad us on with the promise of their seven treasures. Rewards for the worthy, the doorway to divinity. Yet buried in the depths of this world lies smoldering remains, a warning to those that dare trespass. That throne in the sky is not reserved for you. I do love the main character's designs. But mortal irrigation never stops. None will escape the flames. That was weird. That almost sounded like Cloud Fuku Land from Banjo Kazooie. The, the outlander who, who caught the wind. Mondstadt for a millennium finally faces his perturbation. Okay. What does freedom really mean when demanding? I like this guy. God. We met him for a little bit in the bit that I played. The god of contracts senselessly slaughtered as his people watched on in horror. In the end. He will sign the contract to end all contracts. She seems cool. In the secluded land of the immortal Shogun, the Bakufu rules eternal. Oh, Raiden's immortal? But what do mortals see of the Oh, and then there's this girl again. Okay. After by their god. The god of wisdom's enemy is wisdom itself. And Ooh. the oasis of knowledge is a mirage in the desert of ignorance. In the city of scholars, there is a push for folly. Oh, Yet cool! The god of wisdom makes no Anubis? against it. So there's gonna be like an Egyptian themed the chapter god of the story? Of justice lives for the that seems cool! Of the courtroom, seeking to judge all Masquerade the of the gods. Guilty, is this gonna be the, the judgment girl we saw? But even she knows not to make an Whoa. enemy of the divine. Hisoka? Is Hisoka gonna be in this? We got a clown troop. The rules of Reagan's war gonna be happy. In the, the victors oh. shall burn bright, while the losers must turn to ash. So these are the all upcoming characters then. Shares this secret with the traveler. Oh, it okay. Is because she has her <laughs> Powerful God of War kid. Kratos is a child. She is a god with no love left for her people, nor do they have any left for her. Her followers hope only to be Ooh. on her side. Oh! Her rebellion against the divine comes Shadowed out! So obviously this is going to be a story revelation. In the perpetual meantime of a sheltered eternity, most are content to live. The music in this is just unreal. Dream. Seriously! But in the hidden corners where the gods' gaze does not fall, there are those who dream. So this is a story map of things to come for the next, like, what, year and a half? Some say a few are chosen and the rest are dregs. But I say we humans have our human. Okay. Okay. We will defy this world with a power from beyond. This music, man! Now, you who has set foot in this world. Your journey has reached its end, but one final doorway remains. Okay. Step forth if you have understood the meaning of your journey. I'm stepping forth. Defeat me. I'm here reacting. Demand me to step aside. Five Show years and beyond. Four to the, the next night. five years. Wait, wait, wait. So, wait, wait, wait. So, we're not getting to this guy until five years from now? Minimum four? Why are they revealing so much this early? Five to seven years. But I say we humans have our human. Wow! 
we will defy this world with a power. That's kind of hype, though, that they're setting this up so far in advance. Now, you who has set foot in wow. this world. Your journey has reached its So they're saying basically one five to seven years from now, the show's, I mean, at the show, the game's gonna end. Step forth if you have understood the meaning of your And he'll be the final boss or something? Defeat me. Command me to step aside. Show me that you are worthier than I to rescue her. Interesting. Then the threads of all fate will be yours to reweave. Okay. Genshin Impact. All right. My memory has all but faded completely. But I will always remember how much she too loved these flowers. Wasn't there a flower girl in the other uh the other trailer? I like this a lot. So they're given I mean that's kind of incredible that they're giving story teasers for 5 years in advance. So this was revealed on September 27th. We're in what chapter 3 right now? Storyline is currently in Act 2. Next chapter with the Anubis person is going to be coming soon. That's Chapter 3. Interesting. Well, that gives me plenty of time to catch up then. This is great. I have lots of stuff to stream then. I'll probably be streaming the majority of it on Twitch. But then again, if you guys want me to stream this on YouTube, I could stream this on YouTube. Like, how much in terms of story content is there that I have to get through right now? Like, in terms of hours played... How much do I need to get through? I'm assuming like a week worth of content. Probably quite a bit. Plenty. I think streaming this on YouTube might be good. Uh, then maybe I will. The nice thing is I got the game on PC, so it's going to look beautiful whenever I stream it. I might end up just streaming a lot of the story, playing through some of it. Maybe I'll do them. Maybe if a lot of... Let me know. If you watch this video and you want me to stream the story here on YouTube, make sure to leave a like on this video. Excuse me. Leave a like on this video and let me know in the comment section that you want me to stream. And I might make it like a, like a Wednesday stream or a Tuesday stream or something. I'll stream it whenever I get an opportunity. We'll stream more Genshin Impact. This, to me, seems like a YouTube stream type game, though, as opposed to on Twitch. It'll take you a month if you play it every day. It's at least 200 or more hours. Wow. Roger's base is about to be the next big Genshin streamer. Well, I'm excited. I mean, if the story is going to be good, I enjoyed what I played so far. And I already got Lisa, so I know I could play through a good majority of the game. The only problem is how much do you need to grind? It's the kind of game you need to play daily. Oh, boy. See, that's like... I don't have time for that is the only problem. Uh, I think if I do play a lot of it, it'll be something that I'll play whenever I have a free day. If I'm like, you know what, today I feel like streaming some Genshin, we'll stream some Genshin. It's a whole lot of grinding though. But can you play with, I know you can play with other people. So I'm assuming even if I don't play daily, I could hit up you guys, play with you in game and you could carry me through a lot of the story content, right? You really don't need to play daily, and the dailies are only about, like, 15 minutes? Oh, well, that's kind of nice. You can definitely play without grinding, and you certainly don't have to grind to play the story. That is what I like to hear, then. Excellent. Game Prodigy said, if you ever want assistance and you unlock co-op, I'm always down to help. You've already got me added in-game, and you got me added on Discord. Perfect. I will check that out. And Brian said you could test out um, Yolan right now. I might do that, then. All right, well, guys, that is it for today. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I am so happy that I streamed this. I'm finally caught up in terms of the character demos. I'm all caught up. I've got my top 10 right now. I've got the characters that I want to play as. I got the top 10 right here. Yolan, Yaimiko, Shenhe, Raiden, Kazuha, Yula, Hutao, Zhongli, Venti, and Klee. Beautiful. What I'll do, because I saw a lot of people asking about it, I'm going to type in... Hu Tao Japanese, because I saw a lot of people asking about this. So we're going to end it here, and that'll be that. Thank you all so much for watching. Leave a like. If you want more Genshin content from me, make sure to leave a comment once the VOD is up. Here's the Japanese dub. Let's see this. We're going to end this with the Japanese dub of Hu Tao. Here we go. Here we go. This was a really fun stream, man. 
It's gonna take a while for me to timestamp this though, man. Razor is the best electro character currently only playable. Shit! I, I will say hands down, Hu Tao's got the best musical theme that we've heard all day. Like, far and away, the best. No doubt. That hip hop with the. It's great. Not the voice I expected in the slightest. <laughs> so do the butterflies like symbolize death or something? <laughs> That's still so funny. Get in the ground! <laughs> Actually, might be one of my favorite trailers of all the trailers today. <laughs> I like her. <laughs> all right, you guys, that was a lot of fun. I'll be back. Like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs> that, that was a lot of fun. That was really a lot of fun. Thank you all so much for joining me. <laughs> Man, I got a lot of things to catch up on now. Jeez.